Thank you, thank you. You know, a lot of people say to me, do you mind not doing that with a courgette? No, no. People say to me, what is your favorite program on TV? And whether it's in America or whether it's in the UK, my favorite program is Loose Women. I just love that Jane McDonald. She's fabulous. But you see, the thing is, there is a subtle difference between the British Loose Women and the American Loose Women. Take yesterday's main topic on British loose women, for example. Coming up today, do you love the traditional garden gnome? According to a new survey, house buyers are being put off it if they see one of those cheery little chaps in the garden. Then you see there's the American version of loose women, which is slightly different. Okay, well, did Iraq, Iraq attack us, Elizabeth? Iraq did not attack us, Correct. Right? We've been there before. Well, I'm you? saying our enemies... No, I don't want to do this to it. Here's how it gets spun in the media. Rosie, big, fat, lesbian, loud Rosie attacks innocent, pure Christian Elizabeth. Meanwhile, back on ITV, it's far more orderly. Of course, it's about holiday and all that sort of stuff, but far more importantly, it's my dad's birthday oh. today. Happy oh. birthday. Oh, it, it's a big day because he, he officially retires today. Oh. Whilst in America, they're still falling out. Do you believe I think our troops are terrorists, Elizabeth? I yes don't think that no. you... I don't Do think you they, believe that, yes or no? Excuse me, let me speak. You're going to double okay. speak. It's just a yes a or a no. Speak. I am not a double speaker, and I don't suggest. I don't put suggestions out there that lead that lead people to think things and then not answer my own question. Meanwhile, back on ITV's Loose Women... Uh, my teeth are fairly straight-ish, but I have got that thing from the dentist where you only get the gum shield made and oh, you yeah, put the, yeah. the whitener in. I mean, it was probably about two years ago, the last time I used it. It's so civilised compared to the American version of Loose Women who are still arguing. But when you say something like 650,000 Iraqis are dead, it's we true. invaded them. Let me finish. You don't like Who the facts. Terrorists. I like facts. Yes. Do you believe that I think our troops are terrorists? I and mean, you would not even look me in the face, Elizabeth, and say, no, about? Rosie. I can understand I how people might have thought that. But every time I defend them, Elizabeth, it's poor little Elizabeth that I'm picking on. You know what? It's absurd. Thank God back in Britain there's a lot more levity on the programme. Well, I'm out in the wind and rain and hail. And as I say, yeah. good morning, the Belfast freezing air. It's, it's so hard. sore. Mm, yeah. It, it's worth it, though. And yes, before you ask, they are still rowing on America's version of loose women. You said nothing, and that's cowardly. No, no, no. No, no, no. Nothing. That is not, do not. Huh? You will not call me a coward because you Number one, I sit here every single day, so open my heart, and tell people exactly what I believe. So do I, Elizabeth. Do not call me a coward, Rosie. It was I do not yesterday. hide. It was not cowardly. It was, it was honest. So you, what is cowardly? Is there no commercial in this show? So judge for yourself. Who would you rather watch five times a week for an entire hour? Five cackling American yenters going at it, or four gorgeous sex symbols on ITV? I know which one I'd choose. Hi, this is Colleen Nolan, and you're listening to a man who spent the best part of 1975 to 1987, let's say, enjoying himself with my picture, the dirty pervert.